All right, let's go to Marana now. At the end of last year, the Marana Food Bank went under new management, now operating in partnership with the Saurita Food Bank. That's right, Kagan 9's Madison Thomas gives us an update on how the food bank is doing and the big item they soon want to add. I'm going to take you in to the Marana Food Bank and Community Resource Center, where they are seeing new people come each month. And many are people who have never needed assistance from a food bank before. But they're trying to add more resources, including a box truck, to better serve the community. People line up in their cars to receive their food and other necessities. Roughly 3,000 pounds of items are donated by the community each month. The community has been incredible in sharing that we're here, that we're brand new, that we, we're in need of food donations and volunteers. And while donations have been coming in, they say they can always use more. And not just food. Feminine hygiene products and toiletries are always needed. But their biggest need right now is a box truck. In the Salvarita location, we occasionally we loan our vehicle to the Marana location, but um, the, the, the distance, uh, the mileage, the wear, um, it just doesn't make it uh, practical. They say it helps with picking up and transporting large donations. Local stores that host food drives for us, um, even some churches have done big food drives and we need to find a way to get there and bring it to us. They are hoping to raise $25,000 to go towards purchasing the truck. More information and how to donate can be found on our website at kega9.com. Reporting near Greer in Sandario, Madison Thomas, Kega 9.